Whatever. Expert and ace has never been scored on. So maybe we should do a full uh, empty board raid. And go for it. Maybe we should do a full board raid and go for it. That music gets you totally already, so you want to just play that chibi already. Thanks to that beautiful music by Russ Lieblich. He has, an, he has a, the most American German name you could have. Something happened in World War II, can you guess? The stare down. Okay. Please select pilot rating. Yeah, we're gonna start with beginner because beginner was the 357k 499. Push throttle for takeoff. Now we figured out the controls a bit. Let's see about that air rally. No music, but everything else is working. Never seen this? Hey, Demi, how are you doing? This game is called GB Air Rally. Um, we're just playing this for, this, for, the, for the score attempts. Uh, it's rather... Okay. Not too shabby, right? It has simple controls the moment you go into curves. It auto-steers for you, so you just have to, like, set, um, counter... Counter-steer? That's about the game. Jake is like a cake. Just cake. Makes no sense, but we take it. Thank you, Leo Caps, for the five month sub. Wow, those are coming in. So the big question now is why is it no alert trigger for you in particular? That I do find suspicious. I'm sorry, Caps, that there is nothing triggering for you. No two player mode. I'm sorry, Demi. No two player mode. How are you doing, Caps? Okay, we got extra time. So. And now we do the faster takeoff because now we know the controls. Don't worry, he says. Yeah, I'm still thankful, you know. Thank you. I think someone played this game for hours to get the score they had. So let's see if this is a score that just like ramps up the moment you reach um, the finished lap or, or, or race or whatever it is. Because if this is now a one hour playthrough of this game, I don't want to do all three difficulties, I'm sorry to say. But the question is, does this game get difficult? Like, oh, come on. What? An arse pilot. Anyways, Demi, how are you doing? And Caps, how are you doing? What is good with you, boys? Looking forward to the tournament today. Because Amiga Live is hosting Brew Demi Gorgi, um, the I Ivan uh, Ivanhoe Supercars. Please correct me. The Ivanhoe Supercars uh, tournament. What about the Stack Gangu? Good Stack Gangu. Lots of new games uh, to check out. Also arcadey games on uh, on Steam. So uh, stuff is popping. And I got new Strife DLC. And I have to play another character because I cannot play Chip anymore. The way they slaughtered the game in all the interactions just tilts me. I cannot enjoy it. Sin is rigged. Sin seems like a really cool character, but maybe I'm jumping on Bridget. Not sure yet. 
Sin strong. Sin very strong. It's crazy. Um, he get tools for everything, but then again, his DP interactions are rigged. I have an Iron Man Stewart super offer. That's one title to behold. It's a monster of a game title, I do agree. It's just like if you were in a math rock band and you said, hey, let's make a video game and let's give it a cool math rocky name. That's what that's what happened here. And I can't even be mad at them because, you know, it works. Apparently it does. I wanted to play it with Vem and Vem was the smart one. I said, I can't find super games. I was like, it's Ivanhoe, Mac Ivanov, Mac Storoganov, Supercar, Off-Road, Hype Track. And I was like, ah, yeah. Thank you, Vem. Non-Amiga user knowing Amiga better than I do. That's what's up. <laughs> I'm looking forward to, to, to watch the whole tournament unfold today. Because if I only played it a bit, it was okay. It reminded me of Skid Marks. That was about it. And there he is, Deck. See, you just summon Vemir's by talking about him. How are we doing? Does he have reversals? He does caps and he has invul on the first frame, but the interactions are so scuffed with sin, everything can happen. We can play a bit if you want after streaming. Like I'm not going to do a much too much of a long stream today because food is about to, to hit, so I want to finish, finish as much scores in, as I can. Maybe do a second stream um, in the evening to raid over to... Um, okay, what is happening now? What? Do we need to hit these or do we need to avoid these? Or are these just to help me orient on the track? Don't know what's happening. Oh, balloons left. So I need to hit them. Ah, too little, too late. And then there's those assholes. We'll just keep you... Like, I was missing them on purpose, not knowing. That this is what the game wanted me to do all along. Oh, that was a shield. Good to know. That did they also put like shields there? Oh no, is it over now? It's over now. The game is okay. Skidmarks is much better. It's my second favorite racing game on the Amiga Perfect Controls. Super off-road. Just feels chaptic and random. So should be yeah, that's the thing. I like the fact how random it felt. Um Skid Marks is a very solid game, but to be honest, I like the Skid Marks demo better um, than the f full game because this, the, in the demo you could just play. You just go in there and you just play. That was not true for the full version where you could load anything that's vectorized as a car. And there's another game that I like to play as a demo for Christmas. Super Off-Roads. I think it's called, where you have like these super cool 3D graphics. It's like skid marks, but bulkier. When that makes, if that makes sense, I'm not sure. Come on. It's always the green plane giving me a hard time. You know what? I got all the balloons. So, goodbye, sir. I'm fine now. Oh, he says warning. Why? Warning what for? Ooh. Event complete. There we go. I can play with, by the way, Monster Hunter. Yeah, Chaos Mag Magala. I don't know if I want to play more Rise. The way that they roll it out is fine, but then you're just bored after it's out. I definitely got to try this game. It says Skidmux, but it means Skidmux 2. Yeah, Skidmux 2. I, I had the demo for Skidmux 2. So I never had the full game, sadly. I don't know what's happening here, but maybe the game is done. Maybe the game goes on. No, it goes on. Of course it goes on. Level 2, event 1. Okay. I have a feeling that we have to go high, get some altitude in. So we can dive then to get more speed once it's time to dive. That's what my gut feeling tells me. And you should check this out, Demi. Uh, it's actually fun if you like this type of racing game and you want something that adds... It's like Lilith Wars back then, you know? It adds... Or Star Fox for those who are watching from a non-EU region. If you want 
a, a somewhat unorthodox racing game, which adds another layer to it. This one is fine. Actually, this one is fine. Oh, you see the blue one? He was trying to cap us there. What a douchebag. Yeah, we got max acceleration. So when you got time caps. And I need to check out Bridget. I, I mean, I can play Sin from my pocket a bit. What? Of course? Of course, of course. What was this called again? Um, G? G-E-E? -E? B E E, so like G B R rally. Yeah, G B R rally. You gotta ask John if this one is on. Uh, if this one is on Amiga Live already, I I wouldn't be able to check right now, but I would. I would guess he knows about it. You know how John is. He knows all the kind of stuff. And Christmas is nigh. So I'm, I've, I'm thinking about getting a lot of Christmas games, games that remind me of Christmas in. Play a lot of Christmas games, and the most Christmas game I'm even going to touch during the Christmas month of December is going to be Bloodborne as well. I think I want to stream Bloodborne. I'm not 100% sure yet. But Bloodborne is something that would take away a bit from my experience of playing score-based games. So maybe it's a good change of pace, I don't know. But then again, I want to uh, finish this list for December and get done with all the Amiga games for score level up, level up score, fixing all the things up at the moment, because why not? Well, I do have a feeling that this is going to stretch on for a long time and that we're not going to be able to finish this game, that we have to f stream later again. And Amiga can be coming through. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? I know that I need to say good evening in your case. Um, we're doing again our Amiga bucket list. Today it's GB Air Rally. And we already finished um, Gauntlet 2, Galaga 94 and Galactic Warrior Rats, which was, to my surprise, a really fun game. Galactic Warrior Rats was difficult, but fun. Um, pretty much sums up the Amiga experience, right? Pretty much fun, but darn hard. That's why Fire and Ice is one of those games I'm gonna going to do last, because I really want to learn it so I would be able to finish it. It's something I never had as a kid, so of course there's no experience that I can bring along. The purple pink guy here is really trying to throw us off, huh? So listen up, I'm gonna do a speed boost here. Passed by all of you. I'm going to take higher to the skies here. I got the speed. I got the speed. I am speed. And also, Leo Caps, there is Steam Sale right now. So if you really want to get something that you will enjoy, get Sparkster free. Thank me later, Caps. I mean it. 100%. If you get Sparkster free, another Leo Caps stream is incoming. You're, gonna, you're not going to be able to hold your excitement and fun. That Sparks the Free is going to give you. Fine Eyes is a project, right? But then again, I know people which just easily make it to jungle, just like it's nothing. And I have a feeling you have to learn everything about Fine Eyes. Get Pagger Caps, <laughs> cake going for it. You just get home from work, update a website each year with all of the Amiga Christmas holiday games and stuff called the Amiga Christmas Tree. If you're into I'm very interested. Um, you're able to post links here. Would it be so kind to post a link for that, Cammy? Especially meant fly right of red pilots and left of blue pilots. Oh boy. Right. Right of red, left of blue. So it's slalom. This game is actually very fun. I mean, this is beginner difficulty, right? Mind that. I think playing this on a higher difficulty will be much more punishing. Rightfully so. 
But this is a beautiful project, Cammy. I didn't know about that. That's very cool. Not gonna lie. I do want that. I do want to have that list. And I know that Santa's Christmas Capers is on there. I hope that the Super Off-Road x demo is also on there. Because that is jolly fun. Haven't it updated this year yet? I will do that in December, but there's still plenty here. When you say you haven't updated it yet, do you mean like you still find games you weren't uh, aware of? That you put on that list retrospectively? Because, you know, for example, Fire and Ice, you take the Christmas demo. I think it's just perfect. You have one level, it conveys the spirit. Taking the whole game would not work in that regard, right? But there are... It's hard. Many games have Christmas-themed levels already. There was even a Christmas demo for uh, Cannon Fodder, I think. Oh, you had a yearly Christmas game-making contest? Were you doing games as well? Was it um, Amos or Blitz Basic or what was it? That's so cool. I wanted to get into uh, Motorola 68K assembly as well, but... It do be difficult. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. And ideally, I would want to code in Visual Code and not in um, in ASM Pro or similar. But I need to focus on my training at the moment, so I don't think I will be able to get that much leeway in there. But I'm much rather focusing on the Tick 80 at the moment for visual and like creative coding. Learning to poke the RAM on the. Dick is already using up all my brain power as I'm fairly new to the world of coding in that regard. But I do enjoy the journey. People are bringing out demos on the Tick 80 which are beyond me. People are crazy. The green one really blocked me there, but don't worry. When we set our sight on the gold there, dive! Speed boost. All terrain racing Xmas demo. Thank you, Demi. It's it's all blurred because I was a kid and we just had I think over five thousand floppies. Uh, I wouldn't remember. You did a tournament on that last December. I ah, uh, and I missed that. You were in contest and arranged the prizes for the winners, but it didn't enter anything in it. Other people did, and they would use Amos, Splits, Assembly, and make game tools like Backbone, Red Pill, Reality. Crazy. Okay, so it was a full-fledged one. It's your favorite Amiga racing game. See, Demi, we can see eye to eye on your top... Oh, I say top three list, but we know that ATR number one, Skid Marks 2 number two. What is your number three? Will it be Lotus? Super Off-Road? I'm interested to see now what is your number three, Demi. You changed the format from a Christmas holiday themed contest to have a new theme area, Army Game Jam now. Six new games made for it last year. Are any of them on Amiga Live? Because that would already be a feat. And if I can get ADFs on those, let me know. I'd be so happy to run through all of these, even on stream. Give you like a big shout out, like you deserve. It's crazy how much the Amiga community is doing for the Amiga and for the community. Sadly, I'm running a game contest which is NES-based this year. I'm running a Pac-Man Championship Edition D-Make um, contest on Level Up Score. So if someone thinks that Pac-Man Championship Edition is fun, which it is, you should join. If you say, I don't know, you should check it out. And I'll be more than happy to hand you the ROM link because it is unlicensed. So basically, it's legal. Of course. Of course, of course. I had a call from Mums, don't worry, hope everything is good on your end. Many of them are on Amiga Lab. Ah, I gotta check it out. Micro Machines and Lotus 2. Oh, that's that's fair. The thing is with Lotus, I like Lotus 2 way more because of the music, I think. I'm not sure. Lotus 2 and 3 are both awesome, but I like the way that courses are made in Lotus 2. Micro Machines, I'm gonna be honest with you, it's too difficult for me. I would need to learn all the tracks to be able to play the game and I simply can't fathom that fall too much to take in but watching other people destroy courses which are so difficult with pinpoint precision on a Formula 1 car always gives me enjoyment 
I think I've seen you play it uh, uh, with Trap Shot. Could that be Demi? I think that's what I saw. Oh, ooh, ooh. okay, that was that worked. But the good thing about GB Air Rally, as the game we're playing right now is called, I can just talk casually and re-chat because the game is not too demanding on the difficulty we're playing. So, that's a big plus. Let me take the dive. There we go. Big day today, we will know more later tonight. Oh, big day in what sense? There was a Blitz Basic Gym, which I've seen. Um, John played the game. Or was it John? Um, I think John. But the games were played on um, on Amiga Live. And Amiga Bill played them as well, I think. With, uh, with a lady, as far as I remember. We've had two tournaments on Micro Machines so far. I'm probably having another next year. Is it really that popular? The first time I played it was on the Super Nintendo and then on the 64, to be honest. Ah, uh, fuck. Fucking balloon popping again. Yeah, okay. Let's do the button popping. Ah, uh, yeah, now I have... That's that's the worst part about this balloon popping one. That you need to, t to take into account that there will be other people who just fly like the fucking drunk. Intoxicated air traffic. Okay, Sarah. But I think we're doing good, so... You yeah, come on! This dude shot us! Maybe we survived. So we can still go. It's one of the most popular, at least. Yeah, yeah. No, all good, all good, Vem. If it's private detail, it's private detail. Give me all the stuff on Discord, but I can't... I, I can only, like, read an answer after stream is done. But I, I guess you know, so... Not a biggie, right? Okay, I'm gonna turn down the speed. I think, yeah, and then they, they 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 just hit you from behind. That's a clown party right there. Ooh. This event. The Micro Machines fandom is big. It's huge. Okay. Next one. Let's do level four. Oh! I guess he's kissing that woman now. Is it his woman? Like, are they married? Are they a couple? Are they partners? Do they belong to each other? Or is it a random woman he just felt like... Giving a kiss. We will never figure out. We will never know. We'll never know. have to take up here but I'm always looking for a reason to do that because then we can do that take up a bit again cut under him beautiful take up again okay now we gotta look out for them so there's more verticality in play now I like that I think this will be the last S curve we just have a gut feeling so let's speed up here oh, no it ain't yeah, no problem 
Let's get some speed and cut in. They could have added different scenery and maybe weather conditions like in Lotus 2 that would have been perfect. There's always the question uh, which I cannot answer, damn it. Is it that some of the developers were so gifted that the games are that brilliant to play? Or is it a question of time and how well they knew the hardware? What is the reason that they made the game look a bit bland? Because Lotus 2 and 3 are marvels. And people say, Shadow of the Beast is a tech demo, yeah, when the when the Amiga came out. I get that. I totally do. No objections. And I think the game can also be fun. If you're into the type of adventure action game. It can be very fun. But then again, uh, I think Lotus is a way better tech demo for people. Um, even people that never played the Amiga. If they're familiar with this kind of racing genre. Uh, which is typical for that time. Like, people who played OutRun know, know what's up. Um, I think, like, the music, the way the game plays, how it tries to re uh, the stages, using trunks to skip water, having the street barricades, all the kind of things. Um, I think there's so much to be loved. And non-Amiga people will be like, okay, this is straight up awesome. But what are, in your guys' opinion, or your folks' opinion, best benchmark games for the Amiga. Shadow of the Beast fun? I enjoyed it. The one Shadow of the Beast I never enjoyed was Shadow of the Beast 2. I think it's also the most difficult one. The one I enjoyed the most was of course Shadow of the Beast 3. But if you never knew which level order you should take. And some of the puzzles were really mind-boggling to me. Especially as a kid. So I think I played it over the course of 7 or 8 years to figure out 3 of the 4 levels. I never, I never finished the game even. Um... Actually, I should do that. I should learn Shadow of the Beast 3. It, it has some frustrating combat mechanics and some really weird RNG as well. So there's no manip or anything you can do. But uh, after all, I think it was a trouble. Oh, Rough and Tumble. Interesting. I'm very split on Rough and Tumble. Graphics, audio, sprite work. Toppest of notch. Frame rate. And the Euro platformer sliding of the... Of your player character? Not my cup of tea. Gotta be honest. I would... Rough and Tumble is the game that I'd love to love. But I haven't found a way yet to make that happen. Unpopular opinion. I'm pretty sure that's an unpopular opinion. That was uncalled. That was uncalled, but now pink was also coming for me. This air rally is doing numbers, huh? Amber Moon, Credi are coming in, doing Amber Moon promo. And Amber Moon is not a benchmark game. Like Terranigma is a benchmark game for the SNES. King Arthur's World ain't. I took it upon myself to finish it this summer. It was easier than I expected. I noticed I think it's a fair challenge. Is it? Um, we still talk about Rough and Tumble, right, Demi? Uh, I think I made it to World 2 and a half on my first try. And are we considering difficult and controls for package work? No, not at all. I think music, graphics, and maybe gameplay innovation. For example, you know, Viz and Liz is a simple game, but it's very fluid. I think people like it. Um, Tokyo, if you know the original arcade board, but it, nah, it doesn't, doesn't, nah, nah. W I wouldn't consider Toki Punk games like that, like, as a benchmark. It's hard. I think, for example, also Project X could be a benchmark, but the game is piss. Piss tough. Way too tough. I had no chance to play my moon yet, Credit Yard. This is on my backlog, and I don't think that the log will expand to this point until February or something similar, because I still have another 212 Amiga games in front of me where I need to beat the world record. And we're doing that. Day by day. 
And I already worked a lot, but there's still a lot of scores in front of me. I mean, it took me two weeks now to finish a 90 games on a, on a world record pace. But some of them will take a long, long time because very experienced people play these games. This game, for example, has a record of 380k, so I don't think I will be able to finish this run. So we take this as a practice and I will need my own stream only for this game, I'm afraid. Which is fine. The slalom at least is always a nice... Oh, okay. So that can happen as well, and we don't want that to happen. Fair. All-terrain racing too? Yeah, all-terrain racing is beautiful and it's very nice soundtrack. Stardust. Stardust. Ah, oh, yeah, I played Super Stardust. Yes and no. I, I mean, we're brainstorming here, right? I don't want to, like, say what you're saying is wrong. I want to just uh, give my view on it. I want to reflect on it as a, as a streamer, if that's fine. I wouldn't have picked Stardust for the one reason that I think people don't understand asteroids well enough. You need, you need to be old enough. But then again, do you need a benchmark for the Amiga uh, to understand what Stardust does so well? And how fun Super Stardust or Stardust is. But like music graphics, again, you're totally right. Like the criteria for all the things you mentioned is there. It's a benchmark game. Absolutely. I mean, we're just talking about looks. Yeah, I think also game... We can nominate in any category, right? We can nominate in any category. Chaos Engine, yes, sir. Banshee... Do we have better vertical shmups, maybe? I think Battle Squadron is more impressive than Banshee, me personally. Rocket, I don't know. What is Rocket? That one, I don't know. I also think that Glob Duel is a very benchmarkable game. Because Glob Duel has great music, graphics, sound style. Yeah, Apedia. Of course, Apedia. I'm with you on that. I think Agony is a hit or miss. Interesting. I showed people Agony and they were like, what is this? Um, I don't like the music, I don't like the no hit effects and stuff like that. I was like, yeah, but it's, it's art. It's Roger Dean. They're like, I don't care who that guy is. I'm instantly sad and I'm just like, yeah, whatever. It's great talking to y'all. But that is my experience with showing agony to people. Angie's better looking, true. I think in terms of gameplay innovation music, Battle Squadron is just, it just has the sweet spot for me. Battle Squadron just has that sweet spot for me in that regard. But you know, also, like, back in the day, in my early Amiga days, I considered Menace to be a benchmark game. And that is not a benchmark game, is it? Haggle is fun, Leo Caps. One euro and fifty cents. Come on. Steam sale got your back, bro. Rockets is a gravity shooter for the A1000. Oh, I like gravity shooters. Let me check real quick. Have I, do I have rockets on this list here? Ah, I don't. I don't. And is this game ever gonna get tough? I mean, I like the colors of this map, for sure. Uh, that that won't make the difference. I would I would look that up, Demi, but I don't have it on my score list. Could be that the game was just never submitted. But if it has a score and is fun, I'm going to ask for a submission and just make an empty board rate on it. That is my mission for 2023, of course. Um, making more Amiga submissions of games that have no submissions yet. And make them known. What? I thought there was no hitbox for obvious reasons. The game clowned me. It's not a one player game. Oh, is it like Gravity Force in that regard? Is Rocket's Gravity Force in Cooler? Because then I checked it out. I think I checked it out on my own. Is it a PD maybe? 
I know that there are two or three Gravity Force clones, or maybe Gravity Force is the clone I wouldn't know, but um, that's what I remember. I love Gravity Force too. I wish there were people that were really good at the game who wished to play it with me. And there was a four player mode, even if it was serial. Let's play Gravity Force. This is like Liara and games like that, which I could play like day and night. Like one of the games, for example, on IBM, I think it was already, it's a DOS game, but it was already like in the days of Windows 95, 98 was Marshmallow Duel. Is anyone in chat that does know Marshmallow Duel? Such a simple premise, but I love that game. I would do, if we get an IBM Live or DOS Live, I'll host Marshmallow Duel tournaments every month. I'll make it so that it becomes esports. I'll make it so that Korea takes it upon themselves to become the best nation playing Marshmallow Duel. Anytime. Rocket. It just rings a bell, Demi. It does ring a bell, not gonna lie. What bell does it ring? What bell does it ring? Also, jumping checks is a score I'm not looking forward to. And James Bond's gonna be crazy because I gotta watch the Lemon Amiga gameplay review for that one. I just spotted that. Oh, it's a balloon popping. Of course it's a balloon popping. Ah, ha. Get them pop pop reactions. Pop pop. 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 Oh, okay. What do I want? Okay. I'm... Maybe the key here is to give him some space. I mean, right now they're ignoring the balloons anyway, so. Oh, come on. Then turn down a bit. Give him space, turn it back on. That's the trick. Hideous. He survived though. But we're finished with the balloons already anyway, so who cares? I'm just doing this for, for points. thinking if I will stream today again in the afternoon and then raid over to Demi's tournament. Demi, you're streaming on Amiga Live, right? So I can raid Amiga Live for the tournament. That will work. Because if, 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 if that's so, I think after this run is done and when the food is here, I'm... Um, okay, Amiga Live, perfect. Then I'll end the stream today and raid over to someone else uh, after this one here is done. Let's see if maybe Amiga Life is already doing stuff, so we could raid Amiga Life. And further beyond that... Um, we're gonna maybe do a few more runs in the afternoon, so I have enough time to like upload all that stuff and make it work. And... Um, because we still get the whole weekend, right? There's Saturday, there's Sunday, there's Monday. So, we got plenty of time. I mean, last last Sunday stream was fun. The music the music quiz was a, a very good one. Sadly, I had to delete the walk, but that's, that's to be expected. Oh, come on, green. Always blocking. Oh, 
You are such a dick. Holy shit. Amiga, life is life, yes? Yeah, the life is not the, not the thing. Oh, we landed in pig trough. My question is, can you not die in this game? Is this really going on until you're all finished with the game? We had a lot of cancellations for Super Off-Road. Only two people in the reserve slots anymore. What do you mean by we had a lot of cancellations? Oh, how many were in the res reserve slots? So if you guys are interested, I could I could sign up for the reserve slots. Sure, Demi. If you need me, I'll sign up for the reserve slots. And it would be good practice because this would be my first tournament on Amiga Live and I don't know stuff about it. So this would be very helpful for me to get used to the way. Oh, so only... Yeah, so three people moved forward. Yeah. I mean, if there are more cancellations, hit me up on Discord. I'll sign up right away. I got you. I'll be the entertainment horse. I'll be the talking horse. Although no one will hear me talk. i just participate for the reason of one more car. I'll be in the track if needed. Okay... The tracks are getting more interesting after playing this for what, an hour? Creaky. Let's take the deep dive. Also hope Cake is doing well. We haven't heard from Cake in a while. But maybe she's just like uh, checking out stuff, shopping a bit. Lord Fabulous, hey, how are we doing, David? Microsoft Flight Sim, Anno 1840. Now, it's a racing game, but it's a fun one. Uh, 7 p.m. UK time is 8 p.m. for me. Yes, sir. Um, so, works. Don't worry. Works. I'll make... I mean, isn't there like UK versus uh, the US soccer? Not that it's important, but... I mean, it's important to some. Over oh, Mirzu would be signing up all of a sudden. You hated the game when we played it. You were like, I don't want to play this. I'd rather have you move your DD so you have time on the 16th. You know what's up, man. But if you sign up today, I'm pretty sure this will be helpful to just have some more in the reserve. So go ahead, Ben. Sign up. Pretty sure Ivanhoe will be very least with a Belgium participant that's five people so I don't decide it fuck I'm still not the biggest fan of the game yeah I know I mean seems like he lost some time there for untold reasons I can't believe Vem would be going as far as to play this game. Way too nice. It's stack. Oops. Okay. Fly right for the red. Left for the blue. Okay, we got that again. I don't know if I can stick this through for another 150k points. That was a bit too close. I wanted to be efficient. Ooh, let me snuck through here. Gotta pat myself on the shoulder for this one. That was that was quite GB Arelli esque. If we are allowed to label it like that now. For our vast experience of touring through the same terrain over and over again in our yellow funny plane. 
it, at least they could have let you choose your colors, right? I mean, I love yellow. Don't get me wrong. But all the colorful, like, the blue looks so nice. The green is, is perfect. Like, all of that stuff. What time do you reckon you wanna a can of heart? Um, I'll be streaming till cake is here with food. Once cake is here with food, I'm, I'm gonna eat. Then we can play, but I have no leeway yet, David. So you gotta help me out a bit as well. Once all of that is done, um, we could play. So I'd say hour, hour 15. Now, if you don't need our proper sign up, Demi, just fill us in. You can just write cake and um, I'll be there. This game won't end. Are you gonna strive in the meantime? We strived yesterday. That was fun. Uh, but I realized that I don't want to play Chip anymore because how, how the game changed over the time just made the character so unfun with all those fucked up interactions that just don't make chip any more fun you see green is on a, a green tries to destroy us here on my way home nice I don't think that we're gonna be able to finish the chibi air alley. What do you say, Demi? Or them? Is one of the two of yours going to play something on Amiga Live? If you'd be willing to play something on Amiga Live, then I would shoot a raid. I'll do one more. I'll shoot the raid over. Anytime. But the, the sheer pain of thinking that I need to play this thing again. Ah. Yeah, them. Then you'll get back to work in 30. Come on. Maybe Cammy. Everyone's busy. Maybe Cammy's willing to play some on Amiga Life. I would really love to shoot my Ami Bros. Or my Amigos. A juicy raid. But if not, we're gonna shoot it over to Serial because Serial is a super nice guy with a very entertaining stream, and you can actually hold conversations with him while he's streaming. He's reading chat. He's reactive, he's freaking funny, got a shit ton of good emotes. Actually, Serial might be the choice if no one is going to play an Amiga Life. Chip is Bay. Yeah. But Chip is Salt Bay. I can just taste the salt when I'm playing Chip and Strife. He got the coolest special move, that being Vertical Alpha. That's about it. I slacked too much yesterday, gotta make up for it today. Damn them. Clean up your act, guy. Have been working on Alpha Blade PRC for new route into Fuzzy High as pseudo teleports. Ah. Subs were made by new, so probably cold already, but Black Friday discount. Ooh, Black Friday discount? How much? If they're cold already, cake, um, we could just preheat the oven. Put them in. And we'll be good. We'll just leave them in the oven for two to three minutes. Which means I can make a few more laps on this game. Nice. You take your time when you get home. Turn on the oven. Maybe throw them in for a few seconds. And we'll be good. Six something for a foot long? Sheesh! Black Friday be buzzing. Cooking stream? I don't have the setup. If we get a new flat, easy. Booking stream incoming. Till then, not happening. No man aside. Cooking streams are extra comfy. Eating the food that is being cooked is most comfy. Red! Red, you are such a salad leaf. 
I can't cook even better. <laughs> yeah. Cake and I split up our duties. Cake is the baking goddess, and I am the cooking guy. 100% pure entertainment, then. Yeah. When... The thing is, Cake can cook, but Cake is not a cook, per se. For example, Cake can do all these things which other people can't. Like, for example, if she's like, I'm gonna make a sushi bowl, thing are looking good. Other people just can't do that stuff. But Cake can't want to tell you, like, how to make a specific kind of uh, roux, or how to bind a sauce uh, if you deglaze it in red wine, stuff like that. That's me. Cake is the one that does just like the really cool stuff that's exotic. And she puts in so much love when she's cooking. So cake. cake ah! Fucking blue knobhead. This guy is a disgrace for the airplane community. I'm trash man in my household. You're a former Smash player. I would expect nothing less of you, Caps. If you were good at something and be a former Smash player, this would disgust me. It would it would shake my inner core. No offense. Still love you. Hyper focused. Yes, we got the balloon. only I could beat that score because I played this game already for so long. This would be great. And otherwise I have to play this game again for hours in the in the future if I end this now. We are 225k and the world record is 357k, which means 125k, 130k, 132k. Ah, oh. yeah, give her a good smack. Great, you kissed a woman. Now go back into a fucking plane because I got a subway coming up, put long, loaded with goodies. I had got no time for you slobbering up. Women you don't know. For realsies. Let's see how much you can make with one race. You just made your own sub. Nice. Pick it up, boss man. Let me slide through your DMs, Blue. There you go. It's like clonk music. Which can be good and bad. Cheese, ham, turkey, tomato, salad, some mustard, and ch jalapenos is written with a J, bam. Sober up. Your culinary language. This guy. Jalapenos, like if it was a fucking Chapman. Cheese, ham, and turkey? It's like ham and turkey? That's a lot. Yeah, I don't care if you're sober or not. No, Punisher writes stuff better most of the time, Vam. You're, sla you're slacking. You have been slacking the past few weeks, Vam. You gotta sober up your language. You're a coder. Language is your profession. Don't slack on the language, especially for Pujalapenos, who are getting underrepresented now, that the spice world is up to scorpions and chalak, whatever. The jalapeno is like a minority. You gotta give it some love. Give some love to the jalapeno. It's providing you with spice, life. It's fruitful, tasty, yet tangy and spicy. Hello. Cake is here. And she's 
giving the dog a treat because I'm pretty sure he did something pretty awesome. We don't give those treats away for free. Twitch doesn't give me that option. What option? Code makes a little right and see a red line, then I correct it. Yeah, that's... The red line must be in your head here, sir. That red line must be here. Telling you to not fuck up important words like jalapeno. Like, if I ask Steppy to write Stepsister, I'm pretty sure he can nail it because he knows the word step very well since it's called two-step. There we go, Ben. I'm only doing it for you. I'm making you appeal as smart as you are. But you gotta work for it. But look at this guy taking off. He's higher than me and at the same time faster. I call bogus. The moment he comes down, he's slower. The game's reversed for him. He's using hacks. He's using hacks. Thank you, Demi. See? Demi? Demi has a brain avatar. And it's not... It's not for fun. He got that Amiga crank wipe going. And there's a reason for it. That's a curvy map. What is this? This... The way to the plus size model? Uh... Huh? These people are packing their planes right there. Oh, uh, come on. I, I didn't take that one. Well, I think you gotta, like, use your throttle starting at this point of the game. Now I look like a dum-dum. Well, sober up. I mean, you're not Punisher. I know, you're not drunk. But Punisher ain't drunk during the week. Punisher, Punisher actually is one of these guys who's like... Monday till Friday, I'm not gonna... Monday till Friday evening, not drinking one sip. Going out late Friday evening, a lot of sips. Sunday morning, man goes like, fuck. I've been wasted. Still has no repercussions. Goes on with his everyday life. Just these Eastern European genes. Being able to take all that beyond me. Oh, we're gonna set John on this. We're gonna set John on this. We need a BG Turbo Challenge 2 at different looking courses and 2P mode. Maybe just rip the graphics from Lotus 2. We also need the, the, the briefing song from Lotus 3. That's a good one. And we're just gonna say, Owen is on. There we go. Thank you, Cake. That's why I'm gonna be like, yo, John. Would you mind checking the RAM of this marvelous game where random planes hit you from all sides and you just die for it? Thank you, Cake. I, I think I'm going to try to finish this run because I don't have endless time left anyways. And snack, like I take bites like in between. And once I'm done with this run, I'm going to um, end the stream and raid over to someone else. Because that way, my past 1 hour and 23 minutes is not in vain. Spend it on this difficult, because the game has two more difficulties, and I can't... I can't take the idea of having to play this game for 8 hours in total to finish all of it. So I'm going to do a side snack once movie's here. Take a quick track. This is like freaking Paris Dakar. What's with the loading times now? Move on. Crazy. Crazy guy. Oh. Okay. Cop, cop. Oh, it's just at the end. No. It goes always farther. What happened? That was like now a, a picture of both of them kissing each other. It's at the end. The game is still going. I'm so confused as to what this game does. Going for a run. Thanks for streaming. Hey, thank you for coming by, Retro Demi. Urgy, as always. 
looking forward to our tournament, even if I'm just a spectator. We're gonna rate it, and if we're not gonna rate it, we're gonna shout it out. See you later. Thank you. Have a good one. Bye bye, Demi. I'm happy that the tracks are starting to get really short now. That's a good thing. We're close to getting those points in, so I think we can finish that run and then really raid over for good. Because this is... Uh, I don't want to touch this again, to be honest. Like, I have to touch it for the other difficulties, fine. But I don't want to touch it on this difficulty again. I always hate to put the tomatoes and the salad in the oven. Yeah, I think many people can relate to that feeling, but I don't mind cake. Like, you know, when some people bring McDonald's to you in summer, and you get those those burgers, the salad is warm due to the burger being fresh and it's being hot outside, so there's no unproportioned cooling off, but rather uh, the come on, the heat just like prints first. Very well into the other parts. Pick truck. Nice. Come on. Take off, buddy. But yeah. It was a Black Friday deal. For six years, I'll take a cold sub and warm it up. Go higher so we get that. Seppa was in waiting there for a short moment. Seppa? Mama, 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 mama. Oh, time is running out. Maybe our run ends magically. Oh, it doesn't. We still got two seconds. Okay, so those crashes really do hurt your score and the time bonus you get, which means doing messing up the next one is the end. See, we got no extra time. So we're just gonna go now with the OG 130. Messing up will cost us. Then we just take these little speed boosts. I think that like wave dashing, that's probably the way to win this game. And I think I'm not mistaken. This might be the technique to actually get more points and win this game. Wave throttling all the way through. That's that's the way to play this game, huh? Crazy. Okay, we are 60k points shy of doing world record. Let's see. Because we don't know if the game just has a limit to it as well. That is, not, that is also a very viable option that the game says at one point yeah you 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 are done with all 10 levels or something like that so all we could do till then is basically what we had to do But since this is not a race... Oh! We can take our time here.
But I'm sad that you don't get to save time by finishing the the set goal here, but rather keep going for those balloons. Because they don't award that many points. Oh. Two hundred ninety-four k. So, and three hundred fifty-seven is what we want to get. So, sixty, sixty-three k. Let's say sixty-four k, which would be three more stages, if I'm not mistaken. Mhm. Mm no kiss. No, no kiss. One hell of a run. Holy boy. But if we get a first trend, this one, I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna lie here. Let's try the wave dash strat. Oh, I think we cracked the code. Fly like an eagle. Seems to be a technique we need to do because now we only have 10 seconds left. We're gonna carry, I think, two or three seconds over to the next one. Let's see. What do, what do the final calculations say about that? Show me. Two seconds. Take those two seconds. Let's put these on top. We're gonna make another two seconds save here. Calling it right now. GB air rally. Full mode. Going pro now. Starting to smell like cheese oregano. <clears throat> you took cheese oregano as well, cake? Cheese oregano honey oats, best ones. Yeah. 14 seconds safe, mate. That's quite the points. Come on, put them on top. Put them on top. We gotta get those 357k in. We're not gonna take a second second place here. And imagine now the game has a fixed end. Because we're in level 10 event 3. And I'm going to have done all this only to get a second place after all. Come, 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 come. Okay, we gotta turn down the throttle here. Oh, time has expired. Our run is over. Eighty-six percent. Ah, 
Our run is over. Restart? Is there even death in this game? Run is not over? I don't get this. I don't get this game. Not like this. Oh, no, I get double checked. I got top, top, top. Okay, 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 okay. Not looking good. I mean, he's enjoying it. Push, throttle for takeoff. Come on. Come on, bro. Shouldn't do that. We learn. Ooh, ooh. Come on. Ooh. Okay, we're not gonna get any seconds back for this one. Fair. They mean you said you wanted to switch up with them add-ons, but the newbie was dumb then. What do you mean? You piqued my interest, Kate. to do mine first right hold him all the ingredients and then I told him which sauces mm -hmm. that's how subway works I agree and he added honey mustard only honey mustard Well, I only have honey mustard in my sub. Nah, I was so looking forward to garlic and hot sauce. This is rigged. I'll let you finish. I can't... I gotta focus on this score to be honest right now. I want to be pissed at a random newbie at Starbucks, uh, Subways. Gotta see that I get my last points in. Because I think we're really close to finishing the game as a whole. And maybe I just really just missed the... I need a score. Or maybe it just gets in... Okay, I'll read your cake. I got to focus here now for a bit because these tracks are now increasingly difficult. I'm gonna read everything you guys write in chat after that.
Why are we losing time when we're out of out of are we losing time when we exit the parameter? Oh, you didn't get the one you wanted. I'm sorry to hear that cake. And why does the game I don't get it. Like do we get a po point deduction in the end for every crash probably, right? I just crashed and lost time, I think. Come, come. Burf, burf. You think stuff like this existed back then? Air rallies where people really did races on a, on a plane? In a, on a similar scale, I think the number of fatalities must have been crazy. Oh, you're, you're losing time radically if you're out there. Okay, I see, I see. India, when your cake, just take it out, eat yours, give me mine. I'll I'll finish this. I, I have to finish this now. Sorry. Just just put it out. Eat yours. Don't don't wait for me. Eat it. I'll I'll finish this. We are just 14k short. Why are they in that weird color? Come on, 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 I'm losing too much time. Come on, come on, come on, come come. I, I have a feeling that we're so close to the goal here. Mm, that's another, that's another curve coming up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is it over? Yeah. God. God, 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 God. That's difficult. I think that we're not going to be able to play much more because somehow the game is getting so difficult and weird. The game is not going to let me attempt an event twice. One extra try, okay, but I don't think that we'll get two extra tries. trying to cut there as much as I, as I can it's not working come let 
Yeah, I can't focus anymore. There's food waiting for me and I really want that food. And this game has been going on for way too long. I'm sorry, Van, but I don't think I can please your faith any further because my piloting skills are not up to what this game is asking of me, as you can tell. But maybe we'll make it. Just barely, but maybe we'll make it. Come on, come on. Ooh, that was so close. That was so close. Point-wise, we're now above world record. So, and we're almost dead. So let's just see. Let's just see. Special event. Pop all balloons. That ain't special. That's just a nuisance. over it. I'm playing with stick, yes. Which is actually working well with playing games. Crazy, really. Why would you say that? Ah! Oh, that's fine. Our time is running. Ah! Asshole. Our time is running out. Which is a good thing. We're above the former beginner record, so the question is when will this nightmare end? Playing with stick is hard? Nah, you just get used to the stick. See? It's a picture. What happens now? With a joystick, I'd say. With a stick, it's, it's a better, but it's not analog. And analog is what you'd normally eat level 12 the final level because i don't see how someone was able to make friend or maybe this game is really endless until you fuck up twice i don't know I'm, I'm gonna make a food pause otherwise after this event and just not press a button and if it will disqualify me for doing that that's fine so let's finish this race and I'm, I'm gonna eat on stream like the animal i am I'm gonna listen to music in the meantime so you people can see i'm not cheating so that the score is still uh, going That was well done. What's this game called, by the way? G B R Rally. G E E B E E R Rally. G B R Rally. Not G B like Game Boy, but like B, but with a G, and then a B like the B. 
which stings if you step on it or threaten it. You're gonna try this game? Knock yourself out, man. Knock yourself out. Um, didn't you like remember which one you put in cake in what way? I mean, you can do. Yeah. What should I? I there's nothing I can do now. I'm gonna focus on this, and um, just make a 50-50. Each one gets a half of the other one. I don't know. You're gonna figure it out, cake. You're grown up. You got this. After this curve, hopefully. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, please. I will I will do the pause here, as I said. So a stick to my lap. Thank you so much. Oh cake. Cake came through like the carry she is. So I'm gonna have a quick bite. You can see here I'm doing nothing. Game is not paused or anything other. Mmm. I'm putting out music for you. Thank you so much, Cake. Check. I, I, I got mine cake, yeah? 
You don't? But you only have my honey mustard, right? Yours should be easy to distinguish normally. At hope, at least. They're not too hot for you, are they? to read that. Nice, man. If you had chipotle cake, then you would have a red orangey sauce in the sandwich. Yeah, happy red orange, but not liquidy. Thank you, cake. So, some of the stuff. I got to go mass. I wolf that down. And don't worry, Bam. You're my son. I gotta watch out for you until you learn those very difficult foreign languages. So, of course, I'm gonna tell you when you're doing good and you did very well. Spelling how the the way it's supposed to be. It's really good cake. You can you can taste the brothiness of it, but I like it. The, the consistency is much more fun to eat. Okay, food break is over. Thank you for your patience. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that was, we just lost 10 seconds there.
Come on. Fuck. Oh, we are so done. Yeah. Ah, that was way too off off the grid. Last chance for this one. Otherwise, it's gonna give us a full reset and we're done. Oh shit. Oh no, it's a woman. GB. I saw three women walking down that road. And I said, hey women, where are y'all going? They didn't say a thing. Then I looked again. Wasn't birds. I think our our race might be over here. That's as far as will cheap ever be. Come on, blue! Ah. The fun is almost over, Demi. And most importantly, the fun is gone. Oh, this game is getting frustrating at this point. I think this is the long curve, which is going to hurt if we take it the wrong way, so... Let's see if we can take it like this. Oh, we won't make it again, it's over now. If it had a hado meter, uh, 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 a point o meter, yeah. I mean, everything... ...functions... <laughs> Sorry, time expired. Thanks for... Picking me up and putting me down again. Okay, yeah. Nice, but it's a new world record and that first try. Check. 387k, 496. Oh, I'm done with this.